almost live from Hollywood, where all elevators are going down. America's most talked about, most watched alternative late night comedy variety show, Funny as Hell. Starring the hottest man in showbiz, who owns every major star, soul, dead or alive, Dante Diablo. Tonight, Dante's guests are actor, comedian, Kevin Pollack. Love him. And special appearance by Sam Kinison. <laughs> Have him. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Dante Diablo. Hello, 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 everybody. Now remember, you can't spell hello without H-E-L-L, -L, huh? And speaking of hell, welcome to our show, Funny as Hell, with everybody's favorite host, that's me, Dante Diablo. Got a great show for you tonight. Come all the way up from down under, and I'm not talking about Australia. I'm on fire tonight. And you know what? I'm feeling hot, hot, hot. Woo hoo! Ow! Stab it! Hurt it! On the show tonight, we have an old friend of ours, actor, comedian, the guy that does everything. Mr. Kevin Pollock will be here tonight. Huh? A guy who said he'd never be on our show till hell freezes over. Well, guess what? <laughs> hell flows over. And this week, we have the late, great comedian, the one and only, the really dead guy, Sam Kennison. Anyway, it's gonna be a great show tonight. Let's see what our sponsors have to sell, what kind of crap they're pushing down your throat. And we'll be back in a couple of minutes with Funny as Hell with me, Dante Diablo. See you in a couple of minutes. We are back. Right now, I want to introduce you to the father of Riverdance, Mr. Kevin Pollock. How are you? It's true, originally uh, I staged this for the Yiddish theater, it was called the Gefilte Fish Dance, and that Irish bastard ripped me off. Now, let me ask you this. You also do a lot of stand-up comedy. I mean, you want to talk about a hell gig. What was the most hellish gig that you ever had? This is the appropriate show to be talking about. That. I was playing one of these restaurants out way out of town. You had to drive a couple hours to get there for $50. And I'm in the kitchen, which was uh, my dressing room, of course. This is the introduction I get while standing in the kitchen waiting to be introduced. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out of Thousand Island, and now here's Kevin Pollard. That sounds like hell. Good story, good story. Now I'd like to, I'd like to promote a, a movie I have out, Santa Claus 2, I actually play Cupid. I brought a, a film clip. Never you had have a actually... film clip? Never you play Cupid, yeah. I see. Well, <laughs> you know, this isn't the view, Kevin. I love your work, but I don't think Cupid, that this is quite the show. Just listening to the name Cupid is like, like hearing the word the English patient or Merchant Ivory or the movie Titanic. There's certain things that just give me hives. Cupid is one of them, okay? I mean, I'm sure you played a great Cupid. I'm sure you did some great research for the role. Tell everybody what you did. You hang out in gay bars? What did you do? <laughs> what do you have to do to play Cupid? I'm just asking. It's my job. If you're not going to show the clip, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> It's the last time I'm having you on my show. All right. Next week on the show for Dead Celebrity Interview, we have Napoleon Bonaparte, kind of a prick in his own right. And of course, Ozzy Osbourne. You know and love him. I want to thank my guest, Kevin Pollock, for coming out with apologies. All right. With apologies to Sam Tennyson for the Dead Celebrity Profile. We couldn't get him this week. Maybe next week. What are you talking about? I'm supposed to be on the show. I got bumped for this. Yeah, He's I, got a career. Know, I've been trying to get back on the air for 10 Sam, we'll have it on. Go back downstairs. Cool down. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, don't you yell at me. Oh, oh. All right, Sam, we got to go. Come and follow everybody. Thank you. Funny as hell. I am Dante Diablo. See you next week. Talk to you.